Welcome to our text commentary, everyone. We are providing you all updates from the game of Wolverhampton Wanderers and Liverpool FC. To get more commentary like this, like, share, and subscribe to this channel before you leave. The match's referee for the day was Paul Tierney, an English Premier League referee who was born in Wigan. In the third minute of the game, Mateusz Cunha of Wolves unleashes a strong long-range effort into the center of the net, but Alisson comfortably saves it. Joel Modip of Liverpool scored an unfortunate own goal in the fifth minute after deflecting a shot into his own net, giving Wolves a 1-0 lead. In just seven minutes, Wolves had scored their second goal, which was scored by Craig Dawson, who blasted the ball into the net ceiling. Despite the goalkeeper's excellent save, the ball bounces off of him and into the post. With a total of eight efforts for Wolves and seven for Liverpool, Wolves had control of the game in the 32nd minute. Wolves had complete command of the situation. When he Chan Huang, Wolves, sustained an injury, it was the 39th minute. The manager of Premier League team Wolverhampton Wanderers, Julian Lopetegui, a former professional football player from Spain, was compelled to make a move. Adama Traore, Wolves, was brought on to take He Chan Huang's place after the injured player was unable to continue. After a few minutes, Mario Lamina of the Wolves goes down hurt, and the referee stops the game so that he can get medical attention. Despite suffering a small injury, Mario was still able to carry on. The coach is not at all in danger. A four-minute stoppage time was added to the game at the exact 45-minute mark, and Paul Tierney blew the whistle to signal the end of the first half at the precise 45-plus 5-foot minute mark. The second half started 15 minutes later. When Liverpool's Andrew Robertson takes a corner kick in the 49th minute, he throws a beautiful ball into the penalty area, but the opposition's defense is ready and deflects the ball away to safety. Later at the 53rd minute, Mohamed Salah, of Liverpool, makes a yard for himself inside the box after an accurate pass and takes a shot that goes just over the crossbar. 60 minute on the dot, Julian Lopetegui decided to introduce fresh legs, with Raul Jimenez, Wolves, replacing Mateus Cunha. 64 minute, Liverpool leading with the ball possession of 58 colon 42. Darwin Nunez, of Liverpool, came close to scoring but should have done much better. His poor attempt from close range ended up in the gloves of Jose Sa. The referee blows his whistle, Liverpool are awarded a corner kick. Andrew Robertson, of Liverpool, attempts to find the head of one of his teammates with a promising cross into the box, but a defender out jumps the attackers and averts the threat. Exactly 71 minute, Wolverhampton Wanderers had their third goal, when Adama Traore produces a great pass that finds Ruben Neves inside the penalty area who takes advantage of the situation to rifle a shot into the bottom right corner. At the 77th minute, the game come to an end for Stefan Bajcetic who has contributed as much as he could on the pitch. He was replaced by the fresh legs of Harvey Elliott, of Liverpool. 78 minute, Mario Lamina, Wolves, required a medical treatment, so the referee stops play and signals for the physio to come onto the pitch. He was able to continue after the treatment but later got substituted at the 81st minute. 87 minute, the Liverpool players kept the ball around and exchanging a combination of passes. They are waiting for gaps in the defense to open up, but the plan did not work out. 88 foot minute, Trent Alexander-Arnold, Liverpool, attempts to find one of his teammates with a fine lofted pass, but the defense reacts well to intercept the effort. The ball goes out for a corner. 90-foot minute, Trent Alexander-Arnold, Liverpool, tries his luck again, but it hits a thunderbolt of a shot towards goal from long range, but his powerful strike goes narrowly wide of the left post. For additional minute was added, during that time, Adama Traore, Wolves, found some space to dink the cross from the side into the box, but it needed to be more precise to threaten the opposition, no threat was made, then at exactly 90 plus 5 foot, Paul Tierney